build them like that. That's a good thing. There's a bump. It's students crossing the car row, yep. coming to get water this way. Yep. That's why we're still trying to see as we can find every means possible to have a yep. pump installed within the campus. Uh -huh. That's our problem. Do you have uh, Do you have power? Do you have any generators? We don't have no, any. We don't have that. No generators. Even, uh, uh, if we had, no problem. Yeah. Over here that goes dry. Yeah, yeah, right. I see. This. The next village. Is it uh, 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 above the car road or below the car road? Above the car. Above the car. Road. Okay. Oh, We're running. Yeah. How do you look at it? Hmm? How do you read it? <laughs> I read it the same way you do, pal. This <laughs> is a one big rock up here. Right. Yeah, you are here. Yeah. <laughs> we had to I know. Yeah. yeah, so the, the hand pump that we went and looked at mm -hmm. is really in more the, down in here somewhere, it, isn't it? Yeah, where we, we just came from, somewhere around here. Yeah, right on the edge of the swamp. Yeah. This is all swamp here. Well, okay, temporary. Roll that stuff and bring it with us. Okay. <coughs> yeah, that's a rock. That was it all the way. Yeah. Going to this one. This is the kind of rock. Right. Weathered, it changes from that to, to the hard rock very quickly. In a very good situation. Yeah. The, the, the swamp goes dry at times. Maybe during the dry season, it goes dry. Yeah. Now that one over there doesn't. No, no, no. That runs all the time. Always. You got 35 feet on that one, right? Yeah. How much water does that produce? Does it produce quite a bit more than what the hand pump will pump, mm -hmm. or was it just just a little bit? No, not a little bit. Because since we put it, I have not yet gone dry. Yeah. From morning to evening, mm -hmm. non-stop, uh, it still remain running. So any any pump right here will be a temporary thing. That's for the dry season. I mean, rainy season. Dry season will run dry. Will run dry. A smaller, smaller cut. There's less ground up there. Yeah. It's contributing rainwater down here. That's why it dries out like this. Yeah. As soon as it quits raining, the water stops coming. There. Yeah. So we've just we've just ended the rainy season really, and we don't even have any water running through here. That concerns me. Over there, it runs all the time.
let's assume we need to put a reservoir in. I think that's the only way we're going to get water to the top of the hill. Yeah. Is is with a reservoir and a good well down below and a water line yeah. and a generator. And I want to know what you guys are thinking about this. All we need is a water for the compound. Yeah. And every means possible that we can get water on the compound. Mm -hmm. Then we can apply that formula. And because the drilling will not help us right now, you must bother with flat rod. Mm -hmm. And so it will be a waste of time in going through that process. Yeah. So the best thing to do, if there is a, a means on a suggestion you have just mm -hmm. made, then we'll wait on to that. You discuss that with Joy. I think we do that. Because it drain and you're not successful, no, it's a waste. Yeah. Yeah. Where's the resources? <laughs> Let's go back down here. How many of you? I mean, the water level is clear down here. I mean, you know, this is going to be the water level. The water level will rise a little bit yeah. as we go up, but basically that's static swamp water level is where yeah. the swamp is. Yeah. Yeah. And by the time we get up on top of the hill, you know, even the, the, the bottom of the, where we hit the rock is going to be above oh. the water level. Yeah. Where we could come down here, put our money into uh, a four inch well, and put our money into a submersible pump yeah. and a generator. And, and pump from up here, there, the pump up there. Yeah. Just run that generator for a couple hours and do your other stuff at the same that time, place. and and uh, then just shut it off. Yeah. Pump sits for the rest of the time because that you know we can we can get a pump that'll pump five gallons a minute. We can get a pump that'll pump ten gallons a minute yeah. or, or whatever we need, yeah. depending on what the well produces. Okay, let's walk up here and see if we can find. It. Put the water tower yeah. in a convenient place for the compound. Yeah. Yeah, we want to put it somewhere where we can run water lines to yes. different buildings without getting in the way of a lot of things. What we're trying to do between here, you know, just a palava hut, but that, that doesn't matter. Uh -huh. Okay, so we can do something around here. Mm -hmm. Any of this, is, I mean, there's not enough difference elevation-wise. Yeah, you, you, it's no, like you, you, you are the engineer, so you got to tell us we, we, we are only <laughs> adding to your work. Yeah, I would, I would put it any, anywhere up in here is going to be good. Okay. But it's, as long as you don't have a lot of other stuff, water line's not too tough to no. distribute. And it'll all be gravity feed from the tower. So all we got to do is dig a trench and run the pipe over there, yeah. hook the pipe up to some plumbing, yeah. and you tighten the valve, yeah. and there's your water.